Now let's say we have this function analyze work hours and this function will take hours. Let's say we have this list and we want to get the maximum working hours, minimum working hours and the total working hours. And the question is, can a function return multiple values? And the answer is yes. So we are going to say the following. We will say minimum hour. This will be equal to min. So we will use the built in minimum function and we will pass to this function hours, which is the list in this case. We will use max to get max hours and we will use sum to sum all these hours. Okay. Now let's return these three values. So we are going to simply say return minimum hour and maximum hour and our sum. Now let's call this function. So we are going to say minimum hour, maximum hour and our sum. So we are creating three variables to receive the three values returned by this function, which is analyze work hours. This function will take hours, which is this list. And we will print minimum hour, maximum hour and our sum. Let's run and see the result. So as you see, this is minimum hour, maximum hour and total hours. So as you see in this case, this function is returning three values, meaning that it is returning multiple values.